Okay, in this World of Warships random battle, we have one aircraft carrier, four battleships, four cruisers, and two destroyers, and one submarine on each side. We are in the Bayard, which is a tier 8 French cruiser. It's a light cruiser. Has a set of torps on each side. Pretty fast guns. Not great range, but not bad. Reload booster, speed boost, and hydro. We are on the Two Brothers map. This is an interesting map because every once in a while a couple of folks get a wild hair and decide they're going to race up the middle to the other side, usually to die somewhere Awaiting instructions. just outside that gap between the two big islands. Enemy force detected. I am going to try to find a position where I have decent protect protection for my citadel as I do my best to help cover Alpha Cap. Looks like we have about an even split with our team on each side. From the looks of things, they have a about the same kind of split coming around to our side, maybe a little heavier force. That Chapayev is a Russian cruiser with radar. Nuremberg is a German cruiser, no radar, just hydro. But a bit of an HE spammer. Kansas is the heavyweight American battleship. King George is a very decent British battleship. And there for just a second, I think we saw an Icarus which is a British destroyer. Their aircraft carrier is a German Visser, which is not terribly difficult for me to deal with, but carriers in general can cause some trouble. I'm not sure good how good my AA is, but apparently I'm knocking planes down out of the air, so it must be pretty decent. I've gotten eight plane kills so far, almost as many as I've landed shell hits. Shot just a little bit over that Kansas. It appears that the enemy submarine has come into the cap right behind me. Try to send my depth charges over where I think he might be.
like to keep helping my team with this group of reds that are coming into Alpha Cap, but uh, I can't let that submarine take Bravo Cap right behind us. So let me get up here, see where he is. There is a Bliskvika DD that followed him in. I don't know about the sub, but at least I can deal with the DD. One down. Off to a great start. I am still detected. Probably by the sub. There he is. The trick with these airdrop depth charges is to have them land just in front of where you think the sub is going. So he drives right into that zone. I got one good hit on him, caused some flooding. Our Leon is right there. I see an oil slick right ahead of him. Enemy submarine in sight. There he is again. Torpedoes, dead ahead! Torpedoes to port! Enemy submarine destroyed! Now he'll stay down. Interesting mechanics that the depth charges don't actually do any damage, but for some reason they stalled me in the water. Four of their ships are down now. We have lost one DD and our submarine. Enemy destroyer detected. We do have several ships that are pretty low, including our Leon that's right next to me. The Bagioni, which is another cruiser, is very, very low. But we've got that Nuremberg just about out. Leon is going to head on through the gap between the two islands to Charlie Cap. I was thinking of doing the same thing, but I'm in a good place to get some shots on that Kansas as long as somebody can get him spotted. superstructure not on the guns got so much superstructure you think you could hit it easy now I think I'm going to play a little game here a little peekaboo with uh, Kansas and the King George my speed boost I can duck in and out into this little bit of cover between the islands that are way out in front and this big island next to me try to keep getting some shots on that Kansas He's shooting at me, so I'll slow forward a little bit. Then back up a 
little bit. Icarus, huh? You thought you could sneak in here. Knocked out your torpedoes. Thought you could hydro up on me, or smoke up. But my hydro reaches out to 6k. You're in 4k. I think you're going down. <laughs> yes. Enemy destroyer founder. want to push around behind us. Our other Leon has taken Charlie Cap. Now this Leon has gone down to superior forces. Got a fire set. Now... Can't just hide in here though, that won't do us any good. Our victory is in sight. Somebody sent depth charges at me. Right. Let's see if Kansas realizes that Bayard has twerps. Now, I do have twerps on both sides, but it's really an awkward spot I'm in trying to get them where they can be used. All right, I hit him with all three, cause flooding with two of them. Our team has taken the lead. I think our Bayern, the German battleship, will be able to take out that Kansas. Or our own Kansas is also right in there. Okay. Enemy Kansas is down. Friendly Kansas is also down. Now we've lost our Bayern. longer have concealment here so I'm going to go ahead and pull out there and try to get some mobility. Keep the fires going on him. Oh, something is, oh, jeez, 
Baltimore right here. Bad place for me to be. And big chunks coming out of my head. Battle ends in five minutes. Okay, this might not go well, but let's do the best we can. Oh, he dodged my torp. Bummer. Ah. I was kind of hoping to use a ram, but... He had way too much health and slapped mine before I could really react to him. Okay, we have uh, our DD, our Hatsuharu, and our aircraft carrier. Still very good health. Their Baltimore, we just saw, and their Viser. Both are pretty much near full health. I think they can have this cap, and we still have the win. Looks like our Hatsurahu is going to put a good attack on that Visa, though. I'm letting the team know. Only two minutes left. And Dev Strike on the Visa, so Hatsurahu has come through. Now we only have one minute. We will take Alpha Cap. Baltimore can try to chase down our aircraft carrier if he wants to. Probably a waste of time though. Just counting down the seconds. Nine hundred ninety three points. And that's about it. Good game.